Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to automatically convert Excel attachments from a SharePoint list to JSON format. This makes it extremely easy to parse list item datasets for a wide range of purposes in our Power Automate flows. Before we begin, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to our channel. We will start by clicking Create and selecting the option to begin an automated cloud flow. We will use the SharePoint action titled When an item is created to trigger our flow. We will begin by configuring our SharePoint connection, then selecting our site address and list name from each dropdown. I will be demonstrating with a SharePoint expense tracker list template, and the spreadsheet I'll be testing with includes a few generic employee expense categories. Next, we will add a new action and search for the SharePoint Get Attachments action. As a reminder, we will always need to select our site address and list name for each SharePoint list action we use. We will add the list item ID value in the ID field at the bottom. We will now add a new action once again, and we will search for the Get Attachment Content action. This time, we will include both our list item ID and our file identifier ID in the bottom two fields. We will notice at this point that Power Automate wraps this action in a for each control to account for the possibility of multiple attachments in a single list item. We only want this flow to work for Excel attachments, so we will now create a condition. We will first choose the display name value from our get attachments step, and we will then select the contains option from the center dropdown. We will then write out the Excel extension in the second value field. This specifies that our next action will only take place for Excel files. As a quick aside, we could place this prior to our get attachment content action if we prefer it as well. Now we will add a new action in the true branch of our condition. We will search for cloud immersive connectors, and we will scroll down until we find the document conversion connector with the green logo. We will click see more to view the actions list, and we will then search for an action called convert Excel XLSX to JSON. Once we find this action, we can select it, and we will then need to configure our CloudMersive connection. As long as we have a premium Power Automate account, we can use CloudMersive APIs for free with a free API key. Free API keys allow a limit of 800 API calls per month with zero commitments. We will now add the file content from our Get Attachment Content action in the first field, and we will then add the display name from our Get Attachments action in the second field. We will now save our flow and give it a quick test so we can review the outputs. In our response body, we will find Excel data converted into an array of JSON objects. We can store this as text data, and we can also parse this data into a JSON schema for a variety of uses. It's much easier to automate data operations with JSON data. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to a member of our team. 